And it was about a week into my career, actually, at XO. And uh, we you get a call, and as, as any salesperson does, you take the call, and you just go with it and see what, what it is. And it was in Frisco, Texas, a very high-end development builder uh, for an outdoor mall area. Um, very high-end, very high-quality Renaissance hotels and very high-end restaurants. And got a call that they had just built this development several years earlier, and their poles were falling right and left, right? And being a new salesperson in the career, I obviously came to some of my leaders and said, hey, this sounds like it's a bad thing. You know, let's walk through it real quick. And, and through the conversations with the client and their manufacturers and things of that nature, realized that the poles weren't designed well, right? And that they had just put these poles in, they looked great, and they threw these banners on them for marketing. And no one thought about the risk and the, and the consequences of doing things that you're not supposed to do with infrastructure. And through that project, I was able to learn quickly you can't just put a pole up and say, well, it's made out of metal. It's going to last forever, right? Mm -hmm. you, you have to maintain those and look at those. And so through that project, I was able to understand, one, risk that's associated with it, and two, what a client needs to do to, to maintain high level of quality and safety, but also mitigate the costs they're going to have if they don't do anything. And so through that project, we, were un, you know, we kind of got out of it early because it was a battle between the client and the manufacturer, but uh, we're able to ultimately help them with the solution of, you need to replace these poles with a better grade pole, better design, and ultimately they have a safer location now that we actually go to every other year for a conference. We go and shop at this place, which is <laughs> which is really interesting. So yeah, no, absolutely, and and you know we see that quite often mm -hmm. on the kind of commercial side of our business, um, where it's an architect or somebody specking something, mm -hmm. and really the focus on engineering kind of gets lost through all those layers mm -hmm. of of contractor and architect and you absolutely. know lighting contractor and and purchasing folks. And so, yeah, you have a, a development that's a couple of years old and you got mm -hmm. poles falling over all over the place. Absolutely. Uh, pretty scary proposition. Yeah. And they care more about the look of it, right? That was that was the ultimate end game was aesthetics. The aesthetics was more yeah. important than the, than the risk and yep. safety. So uh, and we see that a lot.